located in Charnock Richard, three miles west of Chorley, lived Camelot Theme Park. In these two documentaries, we will be covering what lies there now and what Camelot Theme Park used to be. Resort, it was it was located in the English country of Lancashire. The park's theme was well known for legend of Camelot and the park decor. The medieval elements of the old Camelot theme park made this park so unique in its way. The medieval theme park, some like to call it. Camelot is still standing to this day, but abandoned. But what lies there now is unknown, and we will be covering that in the Wild Willows Camelot documentary. Stay tuned and enjoy. Hello and welcome back to another Wild Willows video here on the Wild Willows YouTube channel. It's been a while Wild Willows, we've just been putting on some Florida vlogs this January but um, yeah soon don't you be worrying we're going to be going to more fun fairs, more theme parks covering all your favourite theme parks around um, for you when you go to theme parks and stuff like that so you know and just have a good time. Um, really so um yeah well, we hope you're going to enjoy these vlogs all over for this year with 2022 um looking forward to october or all that but that's quite a way yeah we've got mardi gras stuff like that to do yet but um yeah the reason i'm here today is we are going to be doing something a bit different on the wild Willows youtube channel we're actually be go going to be doing um some um like a kind of a documentary about Camelot theme park and um, what Camelot theme park was um, there's going to be two parts to this this is part one and um, part two will be out very soon but um yeah it used to be a very medieval park um it closed um in in uh, for in the, on, it closed on 4th of November 2012 so it has been open quite a while um, the, it was closed because of poor summer weather um, and events such as London 2012 Diamond Jubilee I don't know if you've heard of that but um, yeah but it says it on here but yeah so that's why Camelot theme park really closed um it is still i think it is still standing to this uh, day but um yeah it is um permanently closed so um there is no further details of Camelot opening and i don't think it is ever gonna open ever again but it was um it was um it looked like a really um fun park um, really um the Camelot theme park. Um, I know I knew um it had um nightmare there. Um, that looked like a really good ride. Um, Camelot theme park opened on June nineteen eighty seven and closed on the fourth of January um, two thousand and seven. Oh, miscalculation there. Fourth of January two thousand and seven. It closed. Um, yeah, but Camelot um, has um, been um, down for a long time. It used to be a medieval park, and um, yeah, it's all abandoned now. So um, yeah, um, it's very, um, it's very like medievalish, like like in the past of history and stuff. Camelot is, and um, you know. Um, if you the Camelot it's just like medieval stuff like in the past of history and stuff like that so yeah they had a nightmare they had different roller coasters there that would have been amazing for stuff like that so um yeah it, it was a really good park 
I mean, the demolition of um, some of the park rides at Camelot was um, really sad for some people um, in, back in the days, like seeing Nightmare come down, it was really sad for some people and, make, and telling them that this ride's never going to operate again at a theme park or coaster. Um, theme park or anywhere but you know it's not it's nightmares not there now it's never standing it's just demolished as you can see here they're just taking it down in bits so yeah it w must have been really sad for um ongoers like passing through camelot and um yeah it must have been really um sad to see um camelot theme park waste um away like rock rust away into the fading light or something like that it must have been really sad for some people so this part must have bring loads of guests in and as we can see here it's just all demolished now and looks abandoned and very um, creepy and scary like um, you wouldn't think that was like a dream theme park to um, go to would you like now it's all abandoned or rust uh, like there must have been loads of litter around there and stuff and um like really bad stuff but none to think about it like i bet i bet they got quite a bit of money from there but you gotta think now um it's just all abandoned and um yeah um there's camelot sitting to this day and um it just looks all abandoned and medievalish. Like the castle itself looks really abandoned and very medievalish, creepy. So the fall down of Camelot theme park has must have been really um, sad for some people to hear about, you know, with um, their favourite rides going forever. And um, this park is just demolished. It's I don't think it's ever going to come back. Demolished forever Camelot theme park is. And it's really sad to hear that, but yeah. Um, Camelot theme park, the death of the theme park, definitely. But yeah. It's really sad to hear and a park so iconic to a medieval time just wasted away. You know what I mean? Like, it's just wasted away. All that money they could have made, all that new rides they could have made, all wasted. They probably was been up here and then just wasted right down to the bottom. And that's how it became the death of Camelot theme park, really. Um, but, yeah. I don't think Camelot theme park's never going to come back, but for some people who really liked it there as well, must have been absolutely devastated the first time they heard it's um, going to go. But, um, yeah, really sad it has been. But, um, you know, now we've got better theme parks around. Um, we've got Alton Towers, as you can see. Rita, well, don't worry, we'll be getting you this 2022. We will. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's just really sad to... Um, here a classic theme park um gone to smithereens like uh, it lo looks like it's been bombed really from the pictures done it? it looks like someone's they've put a like a massive bomb in and bombed it or something but um yeah it was all deconstructed down cranes taking all the track down and taking all the medieval parts down and um for ongoers and uh, people watching i bet they were like Oh my god it's it's just gone forever and uh, i bet people were quite emotional of it as well you know so um it's really um sad but um yeah i think they ran out of money eventually and um, couldn't afford to keep it open because you think if you're running a theme park what you got to pay like bills you got to pay like for the roller coasters you got to make new development developments and uh, for severe weather as well it was camelot theme park severe um, weather happening um all around and it's just really sad to hear this um medieval classic theme park gone to its death and um it really really sad to hear really but um yeah um let's just be thankful for our theme parks that we have and make sure they never um gonna go um i'm quite concerned about a theme park that might be going i don't think it is but 
it's kind of up to my percentage um but i don't think it might not go for a couple of years going yet but i think actually um like water valley might be um a next theme park to unfortunately have its death but um yeah because we went in 20, 2021 and it was quite quiet actually and um my mum says um lucas just get all the footage before because i think it's not going to be long until it's closed but they're doing quite good with like wall valley but it's just sad to see small individual theme parks just go so that's why we say to you all just support and many theme parks is um you can because if it were like merlin they'd be rich they'd be rolling in money M people like merlin i bet M merlin are doing it right now but yeah but um yeah really sad to see camelot go but i hope you did enjoy the part one of camelot theme park um the death of the theme park uh, people will never forget and um the medieval theme park it never people will never forget um, it's been um, really um, good with this documentary just going around talking about the Camelot theme park in its different ways and stuff and um, I've really enjoyed it I think it's been really good to hear about it and um, the massive castle that stood up as well for the entrance just knocked down like the old memories people must have had from there just looking back on the Camelot theme park now it's dead to the grounds like um no offense but um it is quite um demolished now and it just must be really sad for some people like sorry to all the people who love that theme park and went but investing money for theme parks so is really hard like i wouldn't be one of being one of merlin managers imagine how many complaints we get <laughs> yeah merlin <laughs> drive you loopy don't they <laughs> but um yeah thank you so much for watching this wild willows video um if you are new to the channel make sure to subscribe and hit the post notification bell and like the video up and um yeah we will see you on the next wild willows video and part two of camelot will be um out soon rest in peace camelot theme park there is a land where knights battle for honor where dragons fly through the air where you can experience your wildest dreams or your darkest nightmares it's time to live the legend of camelot